and welcome everybody. My name is Jess, otherwise known by my writing moniker Jalyn, and I am an almost published author. Yes, you heard it right. The book that I've been working on since 2018 is about to be published. I am so excited and I've got no doubt that you are as well. I will admit to happy dances, girly squeals and a few joker-esque grins. But of course this would never have happened if you lot didn't start reading that 20 chapter online book and take a chance on it back in March of 2018. And of course those that have joined and read every single chapter since. I would like to put in a sincerely deserved thank you to all of you who have stuck around both through the period of me rewriting this book which I mean is probably approaching nearly two and a half years and of course the two years where I was originally writing the books up online. There have been ups, there have been downs, there have been long periods of guessing games so I have nothing but gratitude for you all for sticking around. Thank you so much. I don't think that I can express how grateful I am in words um, that you have stuck around and that you have aided in helping fulfill this little dream of mine. Thank you. So the question you're no doubt asking, when? 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 Well, I've got to have a little bit of suspenseful fun, guys. Just a little bit. Also, I figured I'd do this right and reveal the cover along with the day. I actually have with me here the official printed proof of the book. For those of you that are unfamiliar with the, with the editing process as a whole, the printed proof is essentially the last and final copy that the author receives to review before they say I approve and this book may be published. So I got that earlier this week and I have been madly trying to read it as quickly as possible to ensure that there are no mistakes. I did find a handful but considering that it's close to a 280 page book, 10 mistakes that I found was fairly good, I think, for my first novel. But I've reviewed them, I've sent it back, and all I need to do is just approve it, and they will basically press the button. Part of the reason why this video was delayed for a couple of weeks, because I was supposed to publish it back on the like 26th of January. The reason it's been delayed is the printed proof was delayed in mailing it to me. Um, yeah, essentially there was back orders from the printer from Christmas, um, so they had to wait to get those through before they printed my book out. But as I said, got it earlier this week and now we're just basically down to the final countdown. Just to let you know as a side note as well, I have already started working on book two. My hope, now that I am familiar with the editing process, is that I will be able to get it out next year. I can't confirm what time next year, though it will probably be not in the first quarter um, because I now am working a full-time job as well. So that means there'll be less time for me to write. In saying that, the plan is all there on what I'm going to write. I've just got to write it. I will also let you know that these vlogs will be back up and running this year, though at a lesser frequency than when I was originally doing them last year. Um, the reason being, again, because I've got a full-time job now. Um, so they will be uh, released every fourth Thursday of the month with the exception being live streams, of which the next episode will be a live stream uh, and kind of a celebration and a publication live stream. So next time in episode 13, I'll be doing a publishing party live stream on YouTube. Everyone will be free to join. It'll be about an hour long. 
please go easy on me, it will be my first live stream, but I'll have a written plan of roughly what I'm going to do during that hour. All going well, that live stream will occur on the 4th of March between 3 and 4 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. I would do it during the week, but again, full-time job getting in the way. In light of that full-time job as well, gosh, I'm mentioning that a lot now, um, but in light of that job, I will, while I have published a schedule for my Patreon um, content, I may be behind in some weeks. Uh, I currently am, I'm a little bit lax there. Um, but I, <laughs> everything that is on the list, I do plan to publish and hopefully I will be able to catch up within the next couple of weeks or so. It's just been, unfortunately, I didn't really put into mind the fact that I was starting this job and I would need a couple of weeks to find my feet there before I spent time doing more of this stuff. So hopefully soon I will be able to catch up to what's currently happening there. Um, some stuff is on time, other stuff, namely the continuous stories, um, is a little bit behind at the moment. But as I said, I will catch up. On that note, without further ado, here is the printed proof. No, it looks so good, doesn't it? See, see, have a closer look. Oh my god. So, it looks pretty good there, and then we've got the spine. You all saw the blurb and the back cover last week in my socials post, so I won't zoom in on that one too much. If you didn't get a chance to see it, don't worry, I've got digital copies that will play at the end of this video, so you'll be able to see it then in all its glory, because it is beautiful. I love it so much. The illustrator, Jeff Brown, did an amazing job. So, I hope you guys think it's just as amazing. And finally, the official date of publication is only a week away from when I'm filming this. On the 17th of February is when this book is due to be published. I will put the dates for the live stream, the publication, all that in the description box below, along with all of the retailers that I know about that should be selling the book. I say that because there's been communications made to me of what will happen, but obviously I can't predict the future of who will actually put it on their shelves. The book will be, will be available in paperback, just like this one here. Uh, from what I understand it, it is print on demand, which essentially means they will not print the book unless there is demand for it. Okay. So, basically the uh, sellers, retailers, retail sellers, uh, have to order it in order for it to be printed. So, some of the major retailers may print the book just because it's a new book and put it on the shelves that way. Others, you may have to ask your local bookstore to order the book and they, uh, it should be available to them. In regards to the ebook, um, which there will be an ebook as well, it will be available on all the major distributors like Amazon, Kobo, uh, Apple iBooks, those kinds of things. Um, will be available on all of them, but there may be a slight delay due to uh, all the uploading and it's a lot of technical stuff that I was it was communicated to me and I only understood about half of it. But essentially, yeah, it could be up to a week after the paperback book that it is made available because of a multitude of reasons, but it will be made available. Below in the description box, I will also list the prices that I, the author, approved. However, I have been told as well by the publisher that uh, the price of the book could fluctuate depending on who is selling it. Essentially, third parties or retailers have the power to make the price of the book more or less, depending on what their sales pitch or whatever for it is. 
However, for any that are concerned about royalties, I still get the same amount of royalties for every book sold, no matter what price they listed as. The pricing that I put down that, uh, in the description box, the ebook is in US dollars, but the paperback is in Australian dollars. Don't ask me why, it's just what they told me to put it at. So, with all that said and done, happy reading everyone. This is Jalim, the almost author, signing off and wishing that every single one of you remain happy and healthy. Bye.